How's it going guys, Wonderful here. Today I'm going to be showing you basically how to fix some errors, how to download, and how to well, use Vega X. So the first thing you're going to want to do before anything at all, and I'm going to explain this kind of heavily, you have to come over here to your Windows search bar, type W, and then type um, Windows Security security so this is going to come up as the first one you just want to open this and then click virus and threat protection and if you are on windows 7 it's going to look a lot different you might need to type like windows defender or something but yeah so come over here under virus and threat protection settings click manage settings and then under real-time protection turn this off it's gonna ask you just click yes and then um, open up Chrome this is the second thing you're gonna need to do you're gonna need WinRAR I'll have all these links in the description you don't need to worry this is the first one so um, pretty much every computer is times 64 bit by now but if you know that your PC is 32 bit which might be like Windows 7 you could click this but for most people with Windows 10 just click time 64 it's gonna download and then you could open it up it's gonna say I already have it I'm pretty sure because I already do but you just click list click OK done and then boom it's installed so now to the download so the first thing you're gonna want to do is come over to my channel click on the video that will be pinned this is the newest version so just come over here and then on this page scroll down to the description click show more and then this is the first link besides the discord so you just want to click this one and if you have an ad blocker on you're going to need to turn it off but this is the thing you're going to want to do so if you have link for ties premium you could click this if you don't which most people don't just click free access with ads and this is the first thing so you just click add add on wait a couple seconds for it to load and then here it is so it's gonna say I can't add extensions because I'm on incognito mode but if you're not on incognito mode just add the extension and then come back here and then you can instantly remove it again by right clicking it and then clicking remove extension and then okay so I'm actually just gonna show you guys this on my actual browser so I can add the extension so as you can see, it's going to load, you click add, add extension, and then when it pops up, right click it, remove from Chrome. It's not even that harmful, it's literally just like a search engine, I'm pretty sure. But when you remove it, it's gone. You don't need to be worried about that. Um, discover interesting articles, as you can see, random articles. Click X, and then you can just watch the, t the countdown. As you can see, it's just slowly going down. Click continue. And then this is what you could see. I wrote this. Just copy this link. Go to the second one. These should be very fast. It shouldn't take you that long. I guess you can get Link for Ties Premium. It's pretty fast too. It'll take like two seconds. Actually, if I just keep this extension added while I'm doing it, it would be a lot better. So all you have to do is just keep it so pretty much once you're done with this just click continue just gonna bring you to this one which is the second to last link you could do all of these links in under like one and a half minutes it's not that much of a hassle so yeah Wait for this continue and as you could see since I kept the extension all I need to do is just this and then once it's all done you can delete the extension obviously from here just wait a couple seconds boom X out wait for it to load and then here's the final link so once this all loads you'll see free access with ads in three seconds and then once this all loads um, just click the discover interesting articles thing and then once again do the same thing you've always done for these links Two seconds one second boom and then now when you continue 
um, you're gonna see there is I'm actually just gonna enable my ad blocker again and then you could come over here you could remove the extension and then just copy this link paste it up here and then it's just gonna load a bit as you could see this is the download so I'm just gonna download it and because I have WinRAR it's gonna come up as a WinRAR file so you could just close this close this and then once you're on your desktop just take this drag it onto your desktop and I'm actually just gonna turn it into a RAR file and as you could see this is it right here so the first and most common error you're gonna get when you first open it is it's gonna say like there's like a unexpected exception that means that your antivirus turned off again so just disable that but yeah all of the errors that you're seeing right here you could fix them just from this document so just copy this link you could read all that stuff but yeah so now I'm going to show you how to use it so you're just going to want to join any game click play obviously but you need to be in the game first it also has to be on the roblox.com you can do this on the What's it called the Microsoft Store version? So then, once, once you're uh, fully loaded up into the game, click attach. Wait three seconds. Actually, wait longer than three seconds if your computer is slow. It's gonna load, and then you'll see this window open up. You could close it. It's gonna say the API has been loaded. And then, if you come over here to the script hub, or you could use your own scripts, you could paste them here and click execute. But yeah. For themes, it's pretty simple. You could change your own, you could do a custom theme. But yeah. So I hope you guys like this video. If you did, be sure you leave a like, subscribe if you can, and as always, peace.